Hey y'all, for this tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how to make this super cute bobble border. It is one of my favorites. I've used it for my Llama Love pillow and my All About the Yarn pillow, and it's just a whimsical and fun little edging. You could use it on a blanket or a dress or a shirt. Any of those would be super cute. Um, I made this practice rectangle just to show you uh, where to attach your bobble. So you always want to attach on the wrong side of your work because it is two cluster stitches together and there's a seam right here, so you don't want that to face the front of your work, you're gonna want it to face the back. I've attached with a slip stitch here, and you'll do that for each bobble. And then we're just gonna start with this third bobble. Now for this one, I'm chaining five, but you can also adjust that if you like. We're gonna chain five. One, two, three, four, five. They can be longer or shorter if you want. Um, it just depends on your preference. But we're going to do chain five and we're going to count three chains down from the hook. One, two, three. So in the third chain from the hook, we're going to begin a double crochet. So yarn over, insert hook, yarn over and pull up a loop. Now we're going to yarn over and pull through two of our loops, but not finish the double crochet. So um, if you're familiar with the cluster stitch, then you know that that is how you form your cluster. You're going to yarn over again and insert your hook again in that same chain. Oops. There we go. Pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two loops. So now you have three and you're gonna do that one more time. Yarn over. Insert hook, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two loops. So you'll have four loops on your hook. You'll yarn over and pull through all four loops on your hook and that will form your first cluster stitch. So now you will chain three, one, two, three, and you will form another cluster stitch in the top of this first cluster stitch. So you'll yarn over, like you're gonna, like you're beginning a double crochet, insert hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two loops on your hook, but you'll leave this one, not yarn over and pull through those last two loops yet. You're gonna yarn over, insert hook, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two loops, and then we're gonna repeat that one more time. So we have four loops on our hook. Now we have four loops, so we can yarn over and pull through all four loops. So to join your cluster stitches together to form the bobble, you're going to slip stitch in the base of your first cluster. So just slip stitch in that. Okay, and then you're gonna chain two. One, two. And then we will attach, I've skipped two for each of these, so we're gonna skip two single crochets and just attach with a slip stitch in the third right here. And that forms your bobble. You may have to play with it a little bit so that the seam isn't wide open. But that forms your bobble. So it's just a super cute and fun little border. And you can also find those uh, pillow patterns on my blog. Thanks for watching.